Good morning. I am in Jamaica again. In Jamaica. We came in very late last night making my coffee. Mike and I love this brand. True Brew. True Brew Coffee Jamaica Roast. Roasted and grounded. This coffee is so good. This coffee machine is very, very slow. So I am just going to go outside and show you a little bit of the outside this morning. It is 6.48, I think. And the sun was hot, hot. When I got up this morning, the sun was hot, hot and high in the sky but you see this cloud right here it just came and covered it so I said let me come out here and do a video while it's cool enough for me to tolerate it's 82 degrees right now 82 83 degrees and it's just 6 48 in the morning but here we are we just got here here's the house here's our car uh, the rental that we rented from the airport last night. The guard shack right there. Oh my gosh. Mike and Fia, they're still sleeping. I slept so well last night. I slept well, but I must say I didn't hear the ocean. Um, the waves, I should say. I didn't hear the waves that much. I did not hear waves that much but here I am just a few steps and I'm right here by the shoreline by the water already we are experiencing erosion we have gotten several quotes from uh, shoreline protection companies to protect and build back the shoreline the cost is astronomical. I don't think we can escape from doing it. If we don't do it, we're definitely going to lose the shoreline. Because look at it. And the house is right there. So, yeah. It has to be done. Or we're, we're going, all of us will lose these houses. Lose these houses if the short, look at that. Erosion right there. Erosion all along the coastline. Uh, Kingston Harbor is down there. The boats are coming in. Actually, that's not a boat. That's a ship. Container ship coming in with cargo. Mike says all he wants to do on this vacation is to... <laughs> he says it's a work vacation and all he wants to do is to uh, ship watch is that ship watch is that an activity but I guess it's an activity for my husband so that's the old high-rise that they've renovated and this is the, the new one it's two of them but you can't really tell from this angle so one of the things that I want to do this trip is to actually take Fia up to those historical sites. That house there is called the Long House. That's Rodney's Arms. That one up there, I don't know what that one's called. And there's actually another one way up there. And then a very popular one is the... Um, it's like a cannon, yes. A cannon is over there somewhere. Oh my God, mosquitoes. Mosquitoes biting me endlessly. We were giving out mosquito warnings saying that there's dengue fever stuff going on on the island right now. That's caused from being bit from the mosquitoes. Beautiful. Ah, 
so I'm back. We're back for a little over a week, enjoying the house, giving Fia a break. Fia's birthday is coming up later this week. Mike also worked on some projects. Mike just got finished doing two projects um, happening at the same time concurrently. Uh, concurrently means happening at the same time. And he's still working on a project which just came right on the back of those two projects. So I said, I'm taking you. I'm taking you to Jamaica. I need you to relax. Because he's been working so super hard. Working so hard for his family. So look at the erosion right there. Oh my goodness. It's crazy. Beach erosion. Uh, water eroded beach line houses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But just look at this beautiful view. Sun behind the clouds. This is so gorgeous. This is the old Forum Beach in Portmore, Jamaica, right beside Kingston there and right across from Port Royal. I'll do a few videos of Port Royal later on over the coming days. Isn't it beautiful here? I am so happy that we bought this house. It's such a great little reprieve to just get away and to come visit our house. I love it here. 